All right, coming up next, a matchup to determine the baddest man on the planet. The UFC heavyweight title is on the line. Well, for a long time, he's been mentioned with the baddest men on the planet. For a long time, though, the title fight eluded him. Not anymore. Here he is, the number one heavyweight contender, finally making this walk and cracking a smile. He's waited a long time for this. He's not expecting a 25-minute war. He believes he has the power and the skills to get this thing done quickly. I guess we'll find out. So here's the heavyweight champion of the world, the baddest man on the planet. Won the heavyweight title fight a few months ago to become the new champion, now looking to stay that way. Make good on the first title defense, continue the championship legacy, and prove to fans that he isn't just a one and done. If they say I'm not the champ until I successfully defend the belt, let me go out and defend it and prove that I am the man they should be chasing in this heavyweight division. the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. The Russian is 38, the Brit is 42. He is the six inch taller party. He will have a one inch reach advantage. We set it inside the octagon. The veteran voice is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Eve Loving. Now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out United Center in Chicago, Illinois. It's time! Five rounds for the undisputed UFC Heavyweight Championship of the world. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, holding a professional record of 26 wins, three losses. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 260 pounds. Fighting out of Moscow, Russia, presenting the challenger, Sergey Pavlovich. And now, introducing the champion, Fighting out of the red corner. This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 26 wins, three losses. Standing six feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 257 pounds. Presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Tyson Fury. UFC belt on the line, guys. Protect yourself at all time. Obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to your corner. They touch gloves, and we are underway. Are you ready? Are you ready? All right, so here we go with round one. A few months ago, he became the baddest man on the planet, the UFC heavyweight champion. But he is really not resting on his laurels. He said, that is not enough. In order to really be the champ, I've got to defend this belt. A lot of heavyweight champions haven't been able to do so. This is a belt that changes hands a lot. He says, I'm going to change history. I'm going to be the longest reigning UFC heavyweight champion. That begins here in the oh, perfect entry to slam him down. Back 
to the stand-up now. Both fighters upright. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the team. Single collar tie now. Effective punch there by Tyson. Oh, spinning back fist. Didn't see that one coming. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Right hand upstairs. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Oh! Big shots exchanged in the pocket there. Ooh wee! Ooh wee! What a right hand by this young man. Oh, nice pop there from the crowd as he finally gets the takedown. He stayed committed to the offensive wrestling, and now he has his opponent where he is. A sigh of relief from the people watching because they were tired of watching him flail around trying to get takedowns and get defended over and over again. Finally gets it. Now what does he do with the top of the Just over two minutes now to go. And he connects there, DC. Great job landing that point. Still on his feet, but he's not up by much. Oh, nice job to get back up again. You don't want to hang out on the ground with this guy. Looking to land the right hand, he misses. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this? Take him down, cut him. Take him down, cut him, over and over. He's securing these takedowns. Fury gets back up again, nicely done. Big knee lands right through the opponent's midsection. Another nice knee there. Uh, another knee. Hip tosses him down, now we'll see if he can advance position. I mean, right into side control. Oh, nice job working hard, coasting and getting back up. What a punch. And he landed the right hand there. All right, so there's the end of the round. And on one side, thrill on the other action. Catch your breath. Breathe. Listen, you can do this now. I want you to go down and put your combination straight down the middle. I need more of that. Are you ready? You ready? Fight. All right, round two. Next there, his hands look good to him. So fast, I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Oh, nice jab. Nice straight right, Lance. Fury's attempt there is blocked by the opponent. Lands a punch there. Good connection by him on that. Great connect. So fast, so accurate. And watch the ability to land anywhere. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to fix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also going to be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Effective punch there. Oh, he's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Oh. to work within the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every realm of the game.
a full-on display of all of his skills. He did everything in this championship winning performance. He used his wrestling, he used his elbows, he used his pace and pressure to really wear down his opponent so that he can get his hand raised. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Eve Leving has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 39 seconds of round number two. Playing the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Tyson Fury. Right, so heavyweight title retained is the headline inside this arena here tonight. Congratulations to the still heavyweight champ. Uh, once again, proven he's the elite among the elite. Of in a division where everything can change in a second, this guy has brought consistency to something that is so volatile. What a champion, what a fighter he remains, the heavyweight champion of the world.